Hello, come back to Bastion. <gasps> the old world's war. finished, but the new world's just getting started. Shut up, old man. I don't care about you and your words. So let's build an arsenal. The Bastion's a place of peace, but we can hold our own if we have to. Yeah, I should check out the other weapon combinations to see what they all say. Ain't much kid can handle with hammer and bow and hand. There's one in particular I want to try, and that's the mortar and the calamity cannon. Apparently he says something that that's too much overkill, but he says it's something that probably will sound very funny if I look for it. But let's see what I can buy. 50% faster reload! Reloading goes much faster. Turns out those old bones still have some spark in them. Yeah. I'm more fan of the a special surprise in every one of those arrows. Well, why not? Surprises are fun. <gasps> Folks voyage crossed the boundless sea to found Zelandia. It was good living here for a while. Yay! Living is fun. Dying is not fun. Fetching fizz is like a mouthful of nails, but the benefits are worth it. Yes, like being able to go rolling, rolling, rolling. So let's go somewhere. <gasps> Make sure I got a good. Well, I'm thinking gonna go to the challenge later, but first let's go to the sundown path. Gain experience levels to raise maximum health. Riff Raff Rangers. I hope the sound isn't too loud. Loudness is a problem. Couples used to walk the sundown path. Ah, tumbleweed. Ain't here for pleasure, though. Oh, I totally am. I just lied to you. The entire reason I'm here is to get some booty. Just me, or is the game running a little bit laggy? It might just be me. Oh, I wanted to walk on those curtains. Why is everything floating? Why can't I fly? I mean, if everything's floating, I might as well be able to fly. But then... He didn't get his booty. Yeah, I'm a good shot. I'm an MLG Pro legit shot. Somebody gets to the core before the kid. Holy shit! Oh yeah, that's the point of this level. There are some levels where he won't get the core and someone else. The floor starts giving way under the lightest step. The single panic squirt could bring the whole place down. So could a reckless kid, for that matter. Is that a power Red shot? in the old world rain from the sky. God, it's laggy. There. That's a bit better. Yay! Ten experience points! Stray valuables are lying everywhere. Kid thinks twice about risking his high for no. Yeah, like I shot everything that was protecting them. Well, the path ain't exactly open to visitors no more. Security is all fired up. That's supposed to make me giggle or something because it doesn't. <laughs> that wasn't really funny, you know. See, the path was intended for leisurely strolling and such. The kid going all crazy isn't helping. Not so much for noise and tomfoolery. But I like tomfoolery. Oh damn, that was a shock. My controller went all vibrating. Ah! Money, 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 money. Must sky bridges link the path together. Get. Oh yeah, this is pretty interesting. Um, let's try this one. One of them bridges whips the kid along. Okay, this is a tough one. Um, don't worry if you miss any of the items, you can buy them at a special building we can build later. Find a spyglass. Like the ones they'd use to search the stars. 
Sir, I lost one of my stars. Why don't know where it is? always was an iffy proposition. <laughs> Double kill. Changed everything, even where the wind blows. For example, it now blows east. Is that counter? Cool. Fountain heals my body. Body healing fountain. That scumbag needs to stop scumming all over the place. Ah! If we mastered the winds in the old days, we can do it again. But the question is. Yeah, that scumbag, I think, because he's way too powerful. Well, ain't no survivor stole the thing. Might have to heal soon if this keeps up. Take this mine, you bitch! Scumbag ate it by mistake. That was Top a tiny brain. guy. Unlike the kid, that core ain't coming back. But there's plenty of loot in return. And I don't disagree with loot, you know. Go, go, looting rangers! Loot, 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 Miller loot. Used to ship live munitions down the path. Hand grenades! Time to find them. Guess what you get to do? It's wise to toss those things plenty far away. Careful is the only way to go. Fuck. That was awesome. Oh shit, man! Stop falling! You're you an idiot! Fellas need some shut -eye from time to time. So they hide in crates. I don't think crates are a very comfortable place to sleep, you know. But hey, whatever suits your ass. Yeah, we're done. Oh god, I better get out. In all this toil, Kid keeps coming back to an overwhelming question. Who else could have survived the calamity? Nobody! We're all doomed! Yay! Nothing's more fun than a global destruction. Apocalyptic apocalypse. Use the restart button in the proving ground to try again. Yeah, that that's that's a tip so you should be giving when I go to that. that time, but that ain't about to stop us. <laughs> I'm such a snarky little man. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna go with that one. Dread rums brewed from swamp weeds, so its effect is as bold as its flavor. We could always see the stars. We just never could reach them, no matter how high we build. That was before we realized how long a light year was. Before we assumed it was like two steps away. Go, go, Nova Scotia! I kind of need more upgrades in order to actually be able to do that challenge, because it is a butt hard to do. I could try the fang repeater. I prefer to do this one with one particular upgrade, which I don't have. No I place want better than Trapper Shingle for learning to tread light and shoot straight. Trappers had to tread real carefully, or else take a nasty fall. The main problem here is by clearing out the targets while not clearing out the floor. Any good trapper knows never to take a step till the time is right. Come on, you can do this, little kid! Ah! 
Ah! You can do this, little boy. Believe in yourself, and you will believe in me. Master Trapper's got yeah! better hunt. You just got owned, bitch. By Mr. Big Metal Arm. Snooze dart. Stupid attack just makes enemies go sleepy. Because it's a snooze to use. You got problems sleeping? Now the shoot this giant nail in your face and you'll sleep. Handle the shingle. Yeah, they would have been impressed, but they're all pretty much dead. So stop reminding me. That was an awesome upgrade, by the way, but I'm not that good at uh, keeping my... Nudge, nudge. Health up, so I will probably won't be using it. That was still pretty fun. Let's go to upgrade something at the forge. Wider attack spread. Oh, that's kind of bullshitty, but I'm not gonna be using the fang repeater for now. I could. It's actually a lot better than the. Yeah, I think I'll go with it. Let's go get the fang repeater and the katana some. Uh, the repeater and machete. Favorite choices of the Ura hunters we once fought. Look at that! That way you meet. That ought to make those fangs sink in nice and deep. This way you guys get some extra commentary. I don't know. I kind of like the hand grenade. So let's stick with that for a while, shall we? Go cop! Boom, baby. You know what? Let's let's try this because at least we can get that uh, special upgrade. I heard that there's a special technique in which you can do this in single in a single go. You just have to dodge roll into the enemies that pop up. Windbag Ranch was built for gathering squirt extract and copious supply. Because everyone likes some squirt extract. Ain't nothing more healthful. No, apparently it is. You know what's a good idea, kid? If you stop falling. This was supposed to help you, not to. Some folks showed up to make a fast buck. You want to know the idea behind this? It's pretty much throwing the place to test their finest blades. And this is pretty much the point where you're going to shit yourself in fucking rage. I can't do this yet. I need some upgrades for that. Need some good ales. Some good upgrades. You know, the whole shabam. Let's go do one more level and then call it an episode, okay? He comes back from Windbag Ranch smelling good and right. Ew, that's gross. Toggle zoom! War machetes are so quick, you gotta keep a good grip on them. Well, I guess that critical chance is pretty good, but whatever. Didn't have the good rules, didn't have the good upgrades. Let's go to, to Hanging Gardens. Beyond that, there's no telling what happens. The veil hangs over this place. Oh, look at how gorgeous this veil is. I just want to hang it all over the gardens. Like, totally. Mm -hmm. This place is, by the way, very depressing. The dead welcome him with open arms. Actually, he crushed them, so I don't think he's very welcoming. Chop -a -chop -a -chop -a -chop -a -chop -a the calamity took everybody after all. Oh, so it's always very depressing. It's a plain, frozen faces all around. 
Hi, Mr. Frozen. You don't much care to see him. Not like this. Why does everyone These have those folks types? Never saw the calamity coming, but someone did. Someone close. As in personal or just the person that it was close in this area? Who? Stop being so cryptic, man. Someone who ain't like Mr. Beckley and his kindly wife. It was someone like him. Hey, mister! Kid sees him there agape in the flesh. <laughs> it's a snag or two trying to get to him. Oh. He ain't about to stop, no matter what. People complaining that I'm shouting. He's got so many questions after all. That hand grenade is awesome. Just ain't got time for answers. Go, go, hand grenade. Explode right on his face. Didn't make it. But, but they wear matching outfits. They wear matching outfits. There's nothing more indestructible than that. Have you ever worn a, ma a matching outfit? They never saw what it was like beyond the walls. Aw, I'm picking my nose. Nor did the bird boy. Didn't make it. But I liked his birds. They were always chirping. I'm going herpity derp. Herpity derpity derp. <gasps> There's stuff over there. The Jawsons. They didn't make it. But they had such a nice show. They always liked to buy boobs. Grady Senior. Grady Junior. They didn't make it. And now they're Ash. And I chopped them up. He survived. And nobody liked him. He was a dick. Because the apocalypse always makes the dick survive for some reason. Kid Ooh. finds proof enough that man ain't from around here. Ooh, you're a heritage. The Tazzle Spades, a rare sight in Solania before the calamity, because very few are living in the city. Now there are fewer still. Huh. Take that, you stupid statue. Just think, without that man, we wouldn't be here right now, would we? What was he talking about? Well, you'll know who he's talking to pretty soon, actually. At the end of the game, you find out. For now, it's a mystery. To the core survives as well. Kid does yeah. what he has to do. Why is everyone surrounding this thing? I guess I have to chop up these people. Because I'm the butcher, and they're the cattle. Yay! Three. And then, what do you say to a man who's seen too much? Kid hasn't a clue, but he says this. I can go fuck himself. Bye bye. Well, that reset the camera. Hi, Mister. We have to go. Please. I have cookies and biscuits. Mmm, crunchy. He's a proper gentleman, that man. His name is Zolf. No hiding, he's an Ura. Folks like <laughs> him ain't never been a common sight in Ceylandia. He's fancy. He's relieved to see a living face or two. The kid and I introduce ourselves in kind. Both to him and to each other for the first time. My name is Buttface. For Zolf, Ceylandia was like a second home. His real word about his first home, too. Far to the east. Aww. 
We all lost loved ones in the calamity, he says. I don't know how I'm gonna go on without mine. Just keep looking forward. Zolf offers to help me plot the skyways for the kid. At least the calamity hasn't touched the stars, he says. Yay! He was born in the Tazzle Terminals. The Ura sent him on a mission of peace to our city, and he's lived here ever since. Oh, he's not gonna say. We fought the Ura decades ago, but that was then. Things are different between us now. Rocks! Sometimes a single look says it all. Kid says hello, but Zolf's lost in thought. Well, I'm off to do nothing. From behind. The cores. They remember. That's why this place is coming together. That's why things are gonna be alright. Every little thing is gonna be alright. Well, look what we have here. Memorial. Nah, I'm gonna go for the Lost and Found. Because the I lost can fight him. Here, Kid takes fragments of the old world and makes them whole again. Oh, shit, yeah, you can buy uh, things that you... You can buy booze, skills, things you didn't pick up. Like, like if I didn't pick up that bronze telescope, I could buy it here now. Automatically retaliate when injured. Mm, not really too useful. Ooh, that's pretty good. Bastion Bourbon. I like that one. It makes you very survivable. Ooh, fancy. An upgrade for them. All it takes is some fragments. And the Bastion makes it good as new. I think I'm gonna save my money for later. I don't have the money for it. Yeah, I don't have the money for it. I'll see you guys next time in the next episode of Bastion. With the Riff Raff Ranger, the kid. Or is it just the kid? Who knows? But I'll see you guys next time regardless.